Yeah, so what 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 you what, what you wanna what you wanna start off? You wanna start off with the introduction? You wanna start off with 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 your with your podcast streaming name or what what you what you wanna <laughs> This your show. This your show. I'm only I, here to cause trouble. I, I still cause want you to, to, to promote your stuff too. Come on now. Okay, sure. Do your introduction and then I'll say my two pieces. What you want me to say? My name, my my podcast, yeah. where they can find me and all those things. All that, all that. Oh. <clears throat> <laughs> Hello, YouTube world. My name is Jay. I'm one of Des' very, very, very common headaches. And I have my own podcast called The Show Must Hold On. We'll talk about that later. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> there you Man. go. Nah, you, you've been, uh, this is, I think it's your third time, a third or uh, fourth time on, on here. You, you've been, you've been here for a while, man. You've been here for a while. The streets need you. Like, you be talking and I got to talk back. <laughs> I'll be trying, you be man. Saying, you be saying some things, and oh, what, what, what I, I be saying? What, what, what I be saying? Did you see my last comment? You yeah. went live about the fresh and fit, and I had to leave. Yeah. I had to go. <laughs> I had to go. What we talking about? What a man brings to a single mother, what a mother, a woman brings to a single father. Yeah. Let's let's not <laughs> let's not <laughs> let's not get into that because. Boy, so I was so, gonna be the only one talking to myself in the comments. No, it would have been fine. You do talk, talk, talk to the people because they go, people go back and read them. And that's the thing I don't like because a lot of people, because I can see how many people view the lives. Like I'll have mm -hmm. like eight people watching, 10 people watching, but then I'll see like one person's comment. I'm like, bro, jump in the comment, say something. You know what I mean? So I don't, I don't mind it. Say, say, say what you say. What it's you... quick though because like you were live and I don't, I don't really catch your live. So when it was live, yeah. I was like, ooh. Then I had another thought, and I was like, I'm going to be in here talking to my fucking self. Let me just <laughs> let me get out. Let me watch the whole thing and then just have a whole paragraph to sum up everything. That's a fact. That's a fact, yeah. man. But, yeah, no, we, we definitely, we got to get into it with Miss Denia Jackson. What, what's, what's, what's going on with, with, with her? Apparently, she, she, she's launching seminars. She got a book coming. I said, oh, okay. <laughs> Boy, this... So, all right, <clears throat> first off, okay, I followed the whole the whole scandal and everything, and I watched both parts of the podcast, and I also watched Jesse Wu review the podcast as well. We had a lot of similar thoughts, but yes, she has a, a $7,000 seminar, eight months of telling you how to heal from a man like her ex, $7,000. That's a lot of money. To teach me how to heal. And the ink ain't even dry on the divorce papers. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think she's healed? Do you think she healed? Because I don't even think she healed. No, no, there's no way. There's no way. First of all, you tell us all this trauma that Derek, provi like Derek provided to you. And Derek's the one that asked for the divorce. Yeah. Okay, so you would have stayed. All right, cool. No problem. And then the, you told us that you went to therapy to get all this healing for everything, but you don't put the person on who put you through that same course. You're going to recycle their course and sell it for $7,000 yeah. to talk to you. Why do I want to talk to you? You're not healed yet. They just filed the paperwork. Just filed the paperwork. It's not even done yet. Like, <laughs> healed? Shorty, healed? And this was public? Yeah. Healed? Nah, yeah. ain't no way there. Yeah, she she sounded she sounded pretty on. upset. She she sounded pretty upset on 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 the last um what was it called Dear Wifey podcast. She sounded pretty upset. Like it, she sounded like she's done, but not completely done. Like if he was to call her and be like, "Hey, yo, come come through, minute ass over." I think she's gonna slide. I think he's still it. I think he's still smashing. I don't I'm think so. Say. I feel like she's just in a petty. I think she's in a petty mode. Like she's like, "Okay, you want this divorce? Now I'm gonna talk up. Now I'm gonna say a little slick shit." I just think she's going through a little phase but again you're not the one who broke it up yeah. that means you would have fucking stayed you yeah. put on the therapist who helped you do all this shit you're recycling their work to sell it to people and that comes out very nasty because you already talked about Derek had you in a mansion and you ain't have to work no more so you want to keep the lifestyle that Derek provided for you because yeah. he took it away mind you she ain't leave he took it away 
So now you want to go ahead and use all your trauma and shit to make the money to keep the same lifestyle. I ain't falling for it, Shorty. Mm-mm. Yeah. Not happening. Yeah. No, so that's, that's real. Sad. The finish line, I ran past it. So egotistic, so cocky, so conceited. Cause I'm better than your average. I'm mad sick when I spit that shit. When I spit that flow, she gon' want to catch my drift. Soon as a nigga get some money, they try to spit on it. They ain't put it on this bottle, so they can't sip on this. Don't you try to boost me up, don't try to get on, bitch. Cause I'm out like I don't know you, nigga. That's real shit. I'm from a place where you get chased.